Hey guys, it's me, Dravian Edwards, and I am back again with another single video of the Custom Model Showcase. So, you already know the African connection from Big Warming Adventure, so I have did something very cool and very interesting, and it's going to be... Trackmaster Custom Snowy Nia. Yes. So basically, what I just did, what I just did to this Nia, I just detailed the the buffer. I just detailed the white underneath the buffers. And then I just, and then I detailed Nia's eyes, as you can see. Which is very interesting to me, for me to do. And it's my first time by putting these into my engines. So yeah, and then I just did the white smudges on the foot plane that goes here. To here. And even on the other side as well. And even that cylinder thing I just did that. And also a bad thing is this part right there of my custom is just peeling off because I used because I used paint and glue. So yeah. I just might have to stick it on there. I think I might have to do that even more. So yeah. And also for Nia's top, I just detailed all white. Like the top. And I did the same thing like Thomas said Friends 47 did. So yeah. And as well as the roof. And even the coal bunker. And even the buffers at the back, but I didn't even detail the buffers black, but I can get used to it. And I didn't even do much. And I really did I didn't even really do much. I really didn't even really do much of the windows. So yeah. I think I might have to get over with it. The only reason why I use paint and glue because the Crayola crayon and the glue were not holding it well, which almost kind of sucks. So, yeah. And it's just very good. And I'm not sure it's just a little bit shining. And also, I just, just detailed her dome right there. Let's see. And I really like it how this turned out to be, oh my goodness. Okay, anyway. As I was saying, I really like it how this turned out to be. She looks more like a really useful snowy engine. Yes, she still works. It also, it also, I swapped the chassis from my motorized, my motorized Nia that came in the Thomas, Thomas, in, in, the, in the, in her own packaging. So, yeah. And also for the other Nia, she was just from, in the Nia and the elephant set. Uh, Elephant pack actually. So anyway, I'm just giving her a 10 out of 10. Even though I just did almost good, like the details and stuff, and sometimes the paint and glue were just about to peel away. So yeah, I'll, well, I'll go ahead and give her a run in three, two, one. Yeah. 
Oh dear. Same thing to my other engines. Oh, that was a fail. Finally. And there was your run of the Trackmaster Custom Snowy Nia. So, yeah, I really liked Nia, who was a very good character. And I, she was very great at solving problems and stuff. And. And Nia just appeared in Big World Big Adventures with a snowplow, and then we see then we see her again, but but it was but it was with her at Tin of Shed in the twenty three episode of Panicky Percy. So. Yeah. So, yeah. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you do, please give me a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. So, thank you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video, which it will be the Snow Traps remake. So, See you then, and look out for it. And we almost had, and we just had ourselves very good on YouTube, and then in, in, in one month, when December comes, after November is over, you, you. We'll be heading into December, and then YouTube will be gone next year. So, yeah. So, guys, I'm not going to be seeing you again, but I think I really have to do a couple of remakes before the time comes. So, yeah. So, anyway. So, thanks for watching, and bye for now.